Hello Mechanics, and welcome back to Guts and Glory. Or as I say it, way too fucking gory. So, we're going to jump right in, and go right to Rooftop Hop again, because I did not actually finish this in the last episode. Unfortunately. Yeah, I think I got this. So last episode, the uh, problem I was having was, uh, I was going the distance, I was going for speed, when she was all alone in her time of need. I cut my hand off, and became Luke Skywalker. Mars Attacks, Jesus. I think in Mars Attacks, the aliens, like, pissed from their fingers or something. Oh, God. Push it to the limit. I just lost my fucking leg. I gotta love that running joke. It just fits everywhere in this song. In this game, anyway. You can just throw it everywhere. You just fling it around. I'm hoping that this game plays a little more natural feeling. A little more, you know, logical. Oh, turn that way, turn that way, turn that way, turn that way. Turn that, way. <laughs> that didn't even hit the pole that time. Oh. Future version of myself being a dick. <laughs> oh. Dude, that death scream. <laughs> the last level for Guts and Glory called Meat Grinder. And I can see why, because you have saws just up and wherever they damn well please. Okay, here we go. I just butchered that child. Tiptoe through the tulips by the window. Oh god. My child. Oh wow, he actually has a pretty tight turning radius when you like account for the fact that he doesn't know what the fuck he's doing. Dude, where the fuck are you? Rolling on the razor's edge. Get made my child. Oh my god. <laughs> oh, those nuclear landmines? Ha! <laughs> I cannot. I cannot do that? Okay, so what was my barrel roll keys? Was it these? No. I did it. I died. It, I guess. I don't know. I'm gonna have to figure out something to do after this. Oh. Now, if I. Okay. Okay, that was great. Um. Why do I keep doing that? Can I be someone else? Can I be the Yang family? That's a meme none of you will get. Be the, uh, be someone else meme. That's from a really bad webcomic that was really popular. I mean, it wasn't bad, it's just that the fandom was absolute horseshit. Which is the case with a lot of thi- oh, you asshole. Case with a lot of- Really? Face right in the saw. You can't, like, I don't know, control your direction for, like, six seconds to not kiss a buzzsaw in the fucking mouth. There's a, there's a reason I avoid games with toxic fandoms, and that's because I don't want to bring those fandoms into my comment section. Which will, like, ruin the, the whole vibe of the community as a whole, and you know the whole... Oh, fuck. This is... Whoa! That looked amazing. I'm moving around a lot, so my camera's gonna. My audio's gonna sound a little weird. I don't have a camera right now. I'm not wearing my mask. Is there actually a place with, like, mines and shit set? Really, buddy? Great. Okay, now I can try this again. I was, uh, doing some Undertale playing, and I knew that nobody would want to see those videos because the f community behind Undertale is just incredibly toxic at this point. Like, how do you- how the fuck do you manage to sexualize a skeleton? Too many people do that with Lindsay Lohan as it is. This guy has the most incredible legs of all time. I'm just gonna tell you that now, he's climbing a mountain on a bicycle. This man is a legend. I would, like, murder somebody for this guy's legs. Like, the stamina of a god. He could just keep it up. 
stamina of a rap god. Okay, so now we're traveling at supersonic speeds, and I want to crash into this fence. That uh, wasn't what I wanted at all. Right, so that's about it. Yeah, uh, I want to avoid toxic fandoms or games with toxic fandoms behind them. Uh, CSGO is based entirely around its player base, which unfortunately is highly toxic too. Now, I'm not going to like say that. I know there are some good CSGO players out there, some ones that aren't like, you know, Succoblit, Rush B, la 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 troll. You don't have this skin, you're a fucking faggot. The stuff, the stuff like that. The stuff that just, I cannot stand. Where apparently, you know, having X amount of money in a virtual game makes you more or less of a person than the other guy. It's just bizarre. It's just stupid to me. Alright, that's, I got way too philosophical with this shit. I think that's enough for this episode, and I think I've been talking for uh, plenty on this one. Um... As always, leave a like if you enjoyed, subscribe for more if you're new to the channel as a whole, or if you just, you know, decide, hey, this guy's pretty alright. And I will see you all in the uh, next video. Peace out. <laughs>